Okay, kids. I'm counting on you finding this second heat signature. Hopefully, it yields us a bounty of initiator cores. It won't be long till AIM pinpoints the location of the Chimera, and without a base of operations, yeah, well, we won't have much of a chance. So, don't let me down. And good luck. Um, that's a lot of pressure. No, it's, yeah, definitely. Okay, I can't let Mr. Stark down. Jarvis, where should I start? The second heat signature has a few scattered spots surrounding a rather large center, suggesting a significant concentration of potential initiator cores. It must be stored in a single location. A structure, perhaps. Got it. Shock butt two. Got eyes on anything? All clear here! Found a tech stash in section 12, junking it. Hey, I've seen that symbol before. Shaking? Is that what I think it is? not his bright green self. It appears Dr. Banner has been struggling with the passing of our beloved captain, Miss Khan. From his recorded memos, he returned to Chimera determined to solve the events of A-Day, but instead grew more frustrated with his perceived failings. Oh, of course. Bruce feels guilty. It seems they all do, Miss Khan. <gasps>
We're approaching more AIM equipment. Hopefully the kind we need. No cores here. Then let us keep searching. Burnt out the core. They're trying to destroy as many as possible. Then we must hurry. Target spotted. That's the Hulk! We need backup out here! I don't like the look of these guys. They aren't the normal AIM tin can. Miss Khan, I believe they may be part of a group who call themselves the Watchdogs. A radical anti-superhero organization. Great! Looks like they're working for AIM now.
We have scavenged every part of this desert by now. And it's not gonna be enough. <sighs> Am I alone? What? Where are all the other Inhumans? Why aren't they fighting back? I... I... I've seen the Resistance symbols. I've heard rumors of a rebellion, but still nothing? I don't feel sick at all. I've never felt more alive. What if I'm wrong? I know what that feels like. These powers are a part of us. And all I do know, it's a lot better if you just embrace that. Or something like that. <sighs> My dad used to say the same thing. Well, he's a more guy. <laughs> the best. You should head back to the Chimera. Okay. Stay where you are. Come on, man. A uh, kid and an old guy. Old guy. All right. Dr. Pym will see you now. Do H Hank Pym? <laughs> Hank? Bruce? What are you doing out here? I could ask you the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's good to see you, man. Good to see you. Uh, Kamala, this is Dr. Hank Pym. Ant-Man? That was, uh, another life. Follow me. Okay, so this is the heat signature we've been searching for. We have been salvaging weapons, robots, aim tech, anything we can to build up our defenses. Think you could spare some of these initiator cores? You know... Help out a helicarrier in need of some TLC? I imagine we can make some arrangements. Thank you very much. <laughs> what is this place? We call it the Ant Hill. Oh. Not my idea. I think it was one of our anonymous hackers, Tiny Dancer. <sighs> no way. So, so they're all... Inhumans, yes. Many of them were prisoners at an AIM facility. I guess they were fighting back after all. Make yourself at home. We've got lots of ketchup. This place is more than I ever imagined. Oh, hey, Banners buddy. You got a sec? You're the portal guy. That would be me. Theo the portal guy at your service. I'm Kamala. Your powers are awesome. Oh, thanks. But you should talk to Sarah. She's up ahead next to the big surveillance screen and is dying to meet you. Me? Okay. Welcome to the Ant Hill, our little home of misfits. You were in San Francisco on A Day? Bingo. Me and my sister both. Sister? Where is she? Rolling around here somewhere. You'll know her when you see her. You were in San Francisco on A Day? Bingo. Me and my sister both. Sister? Where is she? Rolling around here somewhere. You'll know her when you see her.
that I volunteered to be exposed to. Yeah. And some haven't. I... I think I would do it. If there's a chance it could give me an advantage. You coming home yet? Not yet. My parents kind of... I'll need to take a blood sample in a bit. Oh no, no needles. Bullets don't scare you, but needles do. There are so many people here. I, I didn't think this many Inhumans existed. More keep cropping up. San Francisco is, was a big city. Were you all captured by AIM? No, not everybody here is even Inhuman. Some are friends, family. Others just want to do what's right. Which are you? All of the above. Hey there, welcome to the Ant Hill. I'm Cerise, Theo's twin sister. I've got the same powers as my brother. Portal twins at your service. Want a soda? I can totally steal one from Pim's hidden walking fridge. Theo does most of the people moving around here. I've been directing the renovations, looking for new caves to expand. This place is pretty great. You can't walk in or out, so we feel safe. And you'll get used to the dust. All Sisyphus the robot has been trying his best to sweep up, but it's a losing battle. We're going to try upgrading this place. Ramps are at the top of my list. Hey there, welcome to the Ant Hill. I'm Cerise, Theo's twin sister. I've got the same powers as my brother. Portal twins at your service. All this is useless if I can't do it from a distance. One step at a time, Grasshopper. Good control. Now try the other hand. You mentioned we. Just you and Kamala? D uh, no, no. Tony's. So you two are talking. Something like that? Uh, actually, I have Kamala to thank. She was the one who found the big guy. Interesting. Were you... stuck again? Yeah. Uh, it was a bad one, Hank. Just about over a year this time. Simulation failed. Damn it, seriously? I really thought it worked this time. if I can do anything else. Whoa. Looks like they're testing PIM particles. Hope they get it up and running soon. I need a favor. Hi, you're Pim's desert crawling friend. Did AIM send you here to spy on us? What? No. I'm kidding. I've got cameras in a bunch of those dead mechs you passed in the desert. It was pretty fun watching you kick watchdog butt. Oh, thanks. I'm Sarah Garza, and the whispers about you are already fierce. Good whispers? Hell yeah, we want you on our team. You ever have spare cycles? I've got plenty that needs doing. You are a lifesaver. I don't know what this is, but I bet Sarah will be excited about it.
Need some help over here. Ah, exactly what the doctor ordered. Thanks a bunch. No problem. Happy to help. Want to know a secret? The robots around here are all Pim's pet projects. We've got the first Mark I hanging out in the gear shack next to the stairs. Literally. He's hard to miss. Okay. Guess I can go take a look. Really use an Avenger on this one, you know. Do you require my services? Uh, sorry, sorry, I I'm staring. Sorry. I have no feelings regarding your ocular direction. Every trace of my past has been erased for security purposes. Oh, that's kind of... sad. My programming deemed it inefficient to be attached to such redundancies. I only receive joy through mutual transaction. So, the more I buy, the happier you get? Correct. Goodbye. Don't freak out, but Dr. Maddie Cho wants to see you in her office. Oh, uh, what? Dr. Maddie Cho is me. Drop by the lab. I'll hook you up with some goodies. My hero. <laughs> that was a good... Dang, look at you. I am liking the whole vibe. I'm Maddie, resident biogenius. Don't tell Pim I said that. Or Banner. Secret safe with me. You called me to your office? Yes. Though I am not an inhuman, I am a purveyor of goodies, gear, and gadgets. If you need anything to make you faster, stronger, or stretchier, I'm your gal. What do you get out of it? Being smarter than everybody else. Bring me the right materials, and I'll build you gear to make AIM weep. I've already got some prototypes. Take a look. I'm in awe. Uh, I might be drooling. Can I help you with any of this stuff? Not right this minute. But you could help Pimsy with a little zinger. Check out the war table. He'll fill you in. War table it is. Chin up, shoulders back. You're doing just fine. I think it's time to show AIM what I can really do. What do you think, Jarvis? I think you can accomplish anything you set your mind to, Miss Khan. <laughs> 